everyone and welcome back to another video so this is a quick one um, I've got this haul from Temu and I just wanted to show you so before I get everything out I'll just tell you that if you've not already heard of Temu where have you been because <laughs> there's adverts all over the TV and the radio and they're everywhere including on YouTube so yeah they're basically an online marketplace where you can buy anything um, all sorts of stuff home stuff stuffy car um kitchen stuff storage stuff so yeah all almost anything you can get sort of on amazon you can get here but really really cheap and if you want even more money off if you use the code that's on the screen that will get you if you've not downloaded the app before that'll get you 30 percent off your first order and you'll also get a coupon bundle that's worth about a hundred dollars or a hundred pounds something like that so yeah there are really good deals to be had so why not check it out so I'm just going to dive right in and start taking stuff out. So yeah, there's a bit of a mix today. There's a few things that I really wanted um, that I've seen other people using. So first is this, and these are the little um, toppers that you can put on your gel polish bottles or your nail polish bottles. And I really wanted these because I've got a lot of um, like Born Pretty ones in my drawer. And I sort of look down on the drawer and I can't see without looking at the bottle and lifting the bottle up what polish it is so i wanted some of these to put on the top so let's just see what you get inside so just move this out of the way so these are what you get there's 120 here and you get your clear bits um, and they are flat underneath so you're not going to be able to put anything in there like um you know acrylic or poly gel or anything but you could use gel polish and then we've just got some white stickers and i'm assuming that these just go underneath allowing you to stick them onto the top of the bottles so i will be using those they're going to come in handy right next i saw these on aggie's channel she got some of these, I think, in one of her subscription boxes, but I saw them on Temu and I thought I'm going to try them. So they are these little sponges, but you get this like applicator as well. So I'll open the bag and show you. So the sponges come in a separate bag. So they're just little cubes. And then you've got your little, a little grabber and you push this down and then your sort of prongs come out. You put your sponge in there and then it grabs hold of it. So if you want to do an ombre, you, you don't have to hold it with your hands. I get gel polish all over my fingers when I'm doing it. And then you just do that. And then when you're finished, you just release it. And then you can clean that and use it again. Or you can just use another one. So yeah, I'm looking forward to using those. Right, this is quite a big one. And I also saw this on Aggie's channel. I'm stealing all her stuff. But she has some really good recommendations, so she got something, I don't think it's the same one as this, but she got something very similar, and it's to heat up your, like, you know, if you've got a drink, when I'm doing nail sets and stuff, I can be sat there at the table for ages, and make myself a drink, and then I forget about it, and it's gone cold, but I can put it on here and keep it warm. Um, and not only that, what Aggie uses it for, um, she warms her gels up with it, so she'll put, you know, if it's a really cold day, like in the UK, we've had snow, the last sort of week and it is really freezing outside so all my gel polishes and my gels are really cold and I have to wait for them to warm up um, before I can even use them so this is going to help but this one it says 88 degrees C on there but according to the in according to the information it's got three heat modes on it so I can choose and I think it's pink as well so it is a USB, so you do need to have it, you know, plugged into a USB. I don't think it's, I don't think you can charge it up and then use it on its own. But I did expect that, so. Right, okay, so the default temperature is 55 degrees. And then you can increase it by 10 degrees. So you can have it 55, 65, and then 75. That's really good. So yeah, I'm looking forward to using that. So I will have to try that soon. Right, so the next thing I have is this cute little box and I'm excited for this. 
This is a cute little dappen dish, but look at it. It's oh, it's gorgeous. I saw it on the website and I was just like, oh, I have to have that. It's so cute. So it's got a little lid, but it's like rainbow colored and it's a hexagon shape. So I just love that. So I had to have one of them. And then the next things are going to help me with Valentine's Day nails. Um, not all of them, but there are a lot of like nail art style items now. So I got these and I'm not going to take it out of the bag because you can see what they are. So these are like um, little metal shapes. So we've got hearts, ovals and squares and triangles. And you can do all sorts of things with those. And because they're so thin, you can actually bend them to the shape of a nail. Yeah, you can get these in all different colours, but I wanted the rose gold ones. So next, I've got a little bag with some very, very fine chain in it. So I have got some, um, I have got some gold chain, but I wanted some silver as well. So that's that. I can't remember how long that is. You do pay for how, how much length of chain that you get, but that is, this was like the smallest one. And I thought for doing nails, I want something that's really delicate and really, really small and detailed. And then I got some bags of rhinestones. Now these are supposed to be glass and they do look very, very shiny. So I did want glass ones and these are like uh, dusky pink ones and I love the colour of those. So yeah, I wanted those. Um, these are just your standard white ones and they're all flat back ones but they're all different shapes so you've got hearts and ovals and teardrops in there and then I got some AB ones as well so these are pieces of like abalone shell but they are like white ones. Well, they're not white, they're like sort of off-white, but I just love the colour of those. I've got a lot of these in like pink and purple, but not um, not this colour, so I wanted these. And as you can see, they're tiny, tiny little pieces, which will do really well on nails. Right, next to these flowers. So I already got some of these a long time ago, but I only got like four different colours and they were the very, very lightest colours. And these had a lot of the... The darker ones, the more pigmented ones, so I wanted those. You might be able to see a bit better on the back. So yeah, they've got the flowers in different sizes and they've got also like caviar beads in there as well. So yeah, I like these um, darker pink ones and the, red, and the red and the purple, but there's two different purples in there. So yeah, I really like those. Okay, next I got some hearts. So these are just like little heart sequins. So you can see on the lid there, we've got black ones, red and like sort of pink ones. You can see a bit better there. So they're all, um, yeah, different sizes. So yeah, they'll last me a while. There's quite a lot there. And then I got these butterflies. So these are um, the boxes like identical to the hearts but these are butterflies and um i'm able to see better that way so if you look at them they're not i have got some butterflies that are just like a general shape and they're not they don't really look like butterflies that much if that makes any sense these are properly shaped like butterflies and they really stood out so we've got like rose gold ones and you've got these white sort of iridescent ones silver and gold and then like a champagne colour so there's plenty of different ones there and I didn't have any like metallic ones so I really like the look of those and they're not too big they're quite small and then lastly I got some um like mylar I think that's what it is so this is the white one and we've got all different ones so yeah, I've got a lot of things with flakes in and stuff, but I've not got any, I didn't have any of this mylar. And this is really good for doing um, like gel nails with if you're doing sort of a layered design or you want to encapsulate them in gel, then then this is good stuff to use. It's not so good for gel polish because it is quite um, tricky and they do stick up a little bit, the pieces. But um, yeah, I really like the way that they look when they're encapsulated. So I wanted some of those. So those are like white ones. But then I wanted some coloured ones as well. 
I think we've had a bit of leakage on this one. It's all over the, the bag. Yeah, so my hands are covered in it now. But um, yeah, I'll show you from the underside. So look how, how bright those are. And I just thought they're going to look really good, you know, encapsulated as well. So if you want like sort of a, a milky gel to use and then you, you put these inside, it's going to really stand out. And they'd look good in like clear nails and jelly nails as well. So yeah, they really sort of stood out to me and I thought there's so many different colours in there and they're so vibrant. I love this pink one and this like purpley pink one as well. I like all of them actually. So yeah, that's it. So lots of nail art stuff there. That should keep me going for a while just to add to what I've already got. But yeah, you can't really beat the Temu prices because, you know, everything's just such a bargain and I've never had anything that's not turned up and I've never had a delivery that was late or anything like that. Everything that I've ordered has always come on time and I've been happy with everything that I've got. So I know some people do have bad experiences, but I haven't had one. So I think that's the same with anything, isn't it? Anything that you order online, there is a chance of it getting lost or, you know, being damaged when it arrives, but I've been lucky so far. So that's it for now, but I'll definitely have another video coming up in the future because I'm always buying stuff from here. So it won't be long before I've got another haul. So that's it for this video. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.